Good morning vlog. We took a week off post honeymoon. Did we? This is the weekend after. Or no, this is yeah. two weeks after. No, this is one week. It's been two weeks that we've been married, but it's been one week since we've been home from our honeymoon. Yeah, so we're... So we took one week off because we vlogged on the honeymoon. Yeah. We took I... last week off. We typically vlog weekends. Anyways. It's the weekend, start of a long weekend for Eli because he has Monday off for Juneteenth, which makes me happy because I always have more fun when he's working at home or just at home. So it is 6.59 a.m. and we are starting the morning going to Woody's, which is supposedly like the rival of Konos, Konos which we really like, um, both on Pacific Beach. And then we're gonna do like a little beach walk afterwards, more like yeah. a pier walk. And then we're gonna go to the Little Italy Mercado uh, Market. So, we will obviously <coughs> keep you guys updated. We've got a couple things to do today. It's gonna be a fun weekend. Got a party. And a, a darty. Darty at two. Yeah. So, yeah. And, um, yeah, we're just up and at them this morning. Alrighty. Now we're debating whether it's Woody or Kono's. Our hearts with Kono's and our loyalty lies with Kono's, but we've never been to Woody's and it's more highly recommended online, so we're it? gonna see the menu. Did she get so much food at Woody's that we literally share? No, Kona's. I mean Kona's. Pretty day? The beach does not look good today. Seaweed. Yeah, we had seaweed in Dominican too. Where's it coming from? We're in a seaweed crisis. Delaney says <coughs> that sandwich it's is better than this. It has tomato on it. Hunter? Everything here is good. The potatoes have cheese and bacon in them. And we have company. Hummus that we showed, yeah. No, it's not hummus. It's like they have it basically at every Italian restaurant here. I swear, peanut butter, coconut peanut butter. It's really cool. We're gonna get flowers. The ocean down there. Dinner for tonight, raw meat. Uh oh, can't get copyrighted. We're already going to based on our intro. Delaney is obsessed with this Alexa thing. It's so cool. It's like an iPad. You can watch a movie on it. I'm just saying, if you had little kids and you needed them to sit in their high chair while you were like cooking or something, you should get one of those. Roast goes in the crock pot. Yep, I'm making roast tonight. It's one of my all time favorite meals. Eli likes it a lot too, I think. Yeah. <laughs> um, I also wanted to show you guys though that uh, just a, ch a tip to eating vegetables if you buy whole carrots and cut them which is what i've been doing in the like sticks we eat them i mean haven't we eaten them mm -hmm. like the whole bag we bought a whole bag of whole carrots last saturday today's saturday so it's been a week and i just cut the remainder of them and it's just like a little tupperware so welcome to our fridge um we got a bunch of strawberries we went to the farmer's market as you saw this is the dip that we got Rainbow dip. Mm -hmm. This stuff is amazing. We love vegan. So, like, I cut them like this, and then I cut a cucumber. Um, 
We've been eating a ton of this summer sausage that I also just cut and it's easy to grab. Yeah, 80 cents a So, if your man doesn't eat vegetables and fruit, the way to make them is if you cut it all up and then they'll eat it. Okay, for the roast, you need a packet of au jus, packet of dry ranch, these are both dry, um, pepperoncinis, and the roast. And you cook it on low for like eight hours. Our roast is kind of small, so it might not need eight hours, but I'll show you what it looks like once I get it all in the crock pot. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I just pour everything straight on top of the roast. I like to pour some of the pepperoncini juice in there, which is why it's kind of liquidy. And then you just put the top on, cook on low for about eight hours, and it should be really tender and delicious. All right, guys. Maybe some we, huh? cookies for the movie. True. We just went to the party. Totally forgot to film. Yeah, Always. forgot to film, but all our coworkers were there. We met a lot of John and Anita's friends. It smells so good. So, it smells like a dirty diaper in Walmart right now. But, we're uh, at Walmart getting some stuff for our roast. And, yeah, it was fun. People, here's the finished product. <coughs> Describe it. Bless you. This is the famous. This is the best way to eat it. It's like a roast beef po' boy, even though it's not roast beef. Is it? Yeah, it is. Mm. Roast, I don't know. Um, it is a, a hoagie bun, toasted with Swiss cheese. Mayonnaise on one side, you dice up a tomato. Not dice it, you slice up a tomato, shredded lettuce, fold it in half. If you've got extra juice, you dip it. <laughs> you guys never had it this way. I haven't. So, so I do need to get your first bite on camera. All right. Since this one was the one showing on the camera. Careful, don't it. spill everywhere. Yeah, that's good. Mm. That's so good. That's something right home about. Yeah. Cook this. It's better it's than just too. eating it plain, right? Yeah. Although, on mashed potatoes with like the gravy and everything, it's really good. It too. This good, one didn't make any gravy. This is a summer style. The winter style, I guess totally. you'll just have to like and subscribe for. But Good thinking. Boom. Today is Sunday, and it's like Saturday because Eli doesn't work tomorrow. And we're at Balboa. It's almost noon. We worked out this morning, church, and ate lunch, and now we're here. And it's one of my favorite places in San Diego. It's so beautiful, like it's just, it's like the prettiest place here, and yeah. everywhere's pretty, but. And Delaney's been here, you know, a handful of times, but she's never been here on a Sunday, and what I found out yeah. when, when I came here with, like, with Think Coleman Smart was that Sunday is the most popular day. So, we'll show you, you know, the, plethora of stands and snack places and kind of things to do and things to see so Sunday is definitely the day you should be in Balboa Park if you're visiting. Straight Straight. My favorite like a, building? Like a fair. Sort of, but better food. Well, and just not as gross. Yeah. Actually pretty and, and you want to be here. What do you think? Pretty. <laughs> Flowers are higher than normal. Oh, and look at all the lily pads.
Delaney's dressed as a tennis star today. Maybe it's a sign that she will finally play tennis with me. I play tennis with you. So she's like a century tree or whatever. Yeah, cool. Nearing its end of its life though, according to the plaque. And we're, that's the art village right at it. This is what our mom's gonna get us. I think that? it's the same one. We'll put on our entryway tail. Well, aren't these cool? Yeah. Look how pretty is this one. Very. This doesn't match anything. Studio 39. These are really cool too. I want to go here so bad, but he like keeps saying not today. Not today. We have basketball tonight, 5:30. So we gotta be back. But we, we would want to spend like 10 hours here. We are gonna go soon. The San Diego Yeah, we have to get our passes. All right, guys, we are. Where are we? We're in Old Town, which I didn't even know existed. And what? it's basically like a bunch of Mexican food is what I'm getting the vibe. It's really cool. Like, really yeah. busy. Good vibe. Yeah. Cool. This is weird. I don't know what it represents, but... We have to go in there. Yeah. As you saw, we're in Encinitas for the first time. Yeah, it's super cute. Right by the ocean. I mean, everywhere is. We already saw two little trainers. Yeah. We're kind of just walking around. I've only been here once, very quickly. So, seeing what it has to offer. Probably first we'll time here. here. Yeah, either here or Carlsbad. I think we might venture all the way up to Oceanside. So, Ocean's that way a few blocks off. We're on the main strip. We've ventured out. To the water. Asada taco, shrimp taco, and this big honking California, California burrito. burrito. Everyone gets this, so yeah. this is our first time here at Taco Sand. It's famous in San Diego. This is the one in Sanitas, but we'll try it out. We'll take a bite of your tacos first. 
it's corn tortilla with the like, flour. All right, taco stand. I give it a 9 2 out of 10. That was really, really good. I wanted tacos, but everyone gets the California burrito, and we sat right by the catcher register, and I'd say everybody, everybody ordered it. At least one per party, and I don't know. I really enjoyed it. Delaney smashed hers down, and now we're headed to Del Mar just to kick some rocks and hang out and uh, hang by the beach, I guess, but Delaney's driving. She's still learning how to drive in San Diego, so we thought this would be a, a good time to do that. You know, a little five mile journey, maybe less. Yeah, if we get up to anything in, in Del Mar, we'll make sure to show you all, but who knows if we will. Who knows if we, you know, who knows. Update, we've been home for like two and a half hours, just been laying on the couch. Yeah, Del Mar, we didn't film anything because we didn't really do much. And we did walked, go. Yeah, we, we did get out of the car, but we just walked down and then back. Didn't go to a store or anything, but yeah, we're both wiped out. I played basketball yesterday for like the first time in We just a long did time. a lot of walking this weekend. Yeah, my body's just worn out. Um, but Eli's watching YouTube game, if you don't know, OU won their game yesterday. Whoa. And we're going to yeah. close the vlog here. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next week.